According to reports today, Inter Milan are close to signing Venezia midfielder Tanner Tessman. Milan are set to pay €7 million Euros for the USA International. Now, you might be wondering why I'm talking about Inter Milan signing a player, because the report then says they are going to send them on loan to Everton. This is according to some Italian press and Tutor Mercato are running with it as well. He's 22 years of age, he's right-footed, and he played 37 games last season in Serie B, scoring six goals and getting three assists. He's over six foot as well, very mobile. It is a strange, it feels like a strange one. I get the profile of the player. What I don't get is this arrangement between the two. And if it is a real thing that this is happening, why don't Everton just buy the player for seven million euro? That would be that would be my biggest thing. Um so I don't know. I I'm not fully uh, fully on board with this at the minute because it just seems a bit odd it doesn't it doesn't necessarily mean it won't happen it just it just seems like a bit of a strange one but hey ho let's see what happens with that one uh, Fabrizio Romano reported over the weekend that Amadou Onana to Aston Villa is a done deal it's not quite there yet the 50 million fee uh, and the sell-on clause is also included. Uh, and there is a proposed five-year deal for Onana until 2029. The reason it isn't all fully done is because the medical hasn't been undertaken yet by Ama as he is away. This one isn't exactly out the blue, is it? I think we've known that Amadou Onana will be sold this summer. Villa in the Champions League, they're keen to strengthen their squad. And um, they've gone for Onan. I think personally, I think he'll be a good signing for Aston Villa. And Everton will use the money to reinvest in the squad as well. So we'll, wait, uh, we'll have to wait for you know confirmation of when he's having his medical at Villa. And then obviously he will move on, see what the Blues do. They are working on a few players as we speak. So hopefully they'll come to fruition as well. Uh, Everton have apparently made an inquiry to sign Juventus midfielder and USA international Weston McKenney uh, into Miami are also interested and some Saudi teams have tried to get the player as well. The American apparently will leave Juve this summer. He's 25 years of age now. He's played 34 games in Serie A last season. Didn't score a single goal, which is classic Everton, but he did get seven assists. Uh, Evan have set off today for their pre-season training camp in Ireland. Uh, players like Illiman and Dai and Tim Irabunum spotted as they would men go to work, along with Delhi, uh, Jared Branthwaite also got on the plane. Much to the annoyance of Manchester United fans, uh, people like Mark Goldblitz will be fuming. How dare Everton take their defender on their training camp to Ireland? Uh, but off they go. And finally, uh, sticking with, well, not sticking, but one player who wasn't on the plane for Everton, but he played last night in the European Championship final, Jordan Pickford, suffered heartbreak as England were beaten 2-1 by Spain late on in Berlin as the Spanish lifted the trophy. Pickford had an excellent uh, championship domes uh, named in Marker's team of the tournament, the Spanish publication. It's mainly full of French and Spanish players and Jordan Pickford there. But he has been outstanding for England all the way through and he was unfortunate to be on the losing side last night. Kept England in it, made a string of saves, but unfortunately couldn't do anything about a late winner. That is it for the News Daily. Make sure you give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Thanks very much for watching. See you later.